guys welcome back to the channel today we'll be opening up more darkness to blaze the final path so we're going to be opening up the last 18 this is what we got what i got in the last video and this is what nicole got in the last video nothing too too freaking out about maybe we can get something pretty cool in this one so let's move them back so first up will be this charizard Coat card off the side. All right. One, two, three, four. Start off with Water Type Energy, Avatar, Pokemon Breeder Nursery, Fletchinger, Bone Sweet, Dunsparce, Electrike, Galarian Mr. Mime, Grimer, Reverse Hall of Mimikyu, and the final card looks to be a V. It is Salamence V. Okay. I think I've seen enough of Salamence though. I don't know, I, this might have been my first one. I've seen somebody with Salamence. I might have watched a YouTube video or something, but I swear I've seen Salamence. I know I have the Rainbow Rare Salamence, but I'm still yet to get that uh, full art or the VMAX. So these two boxes are pretty good for collectors. And from what we got from the booster box seems to be more for competitive players. With me getting the Crobat V. Let's try and get that Crobat V full art now. Okay, Hidden, Dark Energy, Parasect, Toxapex, Clink, Skitty, Panasage, Golet, Vanalic, Reverse Hall of Electric, and the final card. We have a uh, Vanalix. We cut off to the side. So uh, let's do it. One, two, three, four. Sinosaur, Lunatone, Starvia, Shelmet, Larvitar, Glamour, Galarian Aramaca, Center, Reverse Hollow, a Galarian Farfetch'd. But a heart will be a Santa Scorch V. Another one. Okay. All right. It's not too bad. You know, it's only our third one. It's almost as bad as Glaring Slowbro. Yeah, let's just hope a fourth one doesn't come. I don't think you can get duplicates, uh, ultra rares in a booster box. Comment down below if you can. I don't know. I really should be starting naming out the Pokemon. And instead of rushing through this, I should really be enjoying it. Because overall, this is really fun. One, two, three, four. Anything I would want to desperately know about a booster box, it would probably be if you can get duplicates from them. Yeah. Puppetar, Zalos, Fletchender, Skolvit, Spinarak, Larvesta, Hippopotas, and Rose Hall of a Larvitar. But yeah, from my experience, uh, I haven't seen there able to be a duplicate in a booster box. Not a big fan, though, of the Sword and Shield Hollows. There's literally no holographic pattern whatsoever. It's just tinted to the Pokemon's typing. Final card. We'll be all right, Perrier V. Okay. That's another one we already have. Kind of through with Rhyperior V. So many. We can't even trade each other because we both got some Discord and Rhyperior V. So, so far, not the best start. To these last 18 packs this one's green so i'm just gonna quickly go through this one i really shouldn't be doing this i even if the color of the code i still should be going through the pack for this next one i'm not even gonna look at the code card yeah because that always gives it away whether you should be excited one two three four yep okay dark type energy rare fossil ferret fluffy gullet skitty dino Jigglypuff, Dunsparce, Reverse Hollow of Piers. That's a nice one. Final card. Will be a Manectric. So that was green. Oh, God. Okay, we still got a couple of packs left. Quite a bit, actually. We're trying to finish up the box. So I'm not even going to look at this code card either. So set the code card off to the side. Okay. One, two, three, four. 
Water Energy, Glen Boy Tango, Lyron, Simi Poor, Lucky D, Galarian Mr. Mime, Electric, Dino, First Hall of Cape of Toughness, Bone Card, will be a Tyranitar Hollow. The reason why I separate all the Ultra Rares from the Hollows and everything, because I really should be sleeping Hollows. That's really what you're supposed to do, because it's also a white code. Flimmer Bell. But uh, the reason why is because I actually have them in separate binders between the uh, Ultra Rares and the regular cards. I count Hollows and all that kind of stuff as regular cards, because it's not like they are a difference. Unless you actually own the card, you can't really tell. Like, if you look on Poke Collector, it just looks like a regular card. If you look in a manual, unless you actually own the card, you cannot tell if it's hollow or not. Just kind of sad, actually. So this next pack, no matter the color of the code, I'm going to actually thoroughly go through it. I'm also happy that I got myself a Charizard VMAX. Now, at the point of the video, I had no clue the value of that. Dartrix, the Dene, Bird Keeper, Clink, Skitty, Pansage, Golit, Vanillic, Rissol of a Bear Tick, Final Card, the Digger's Bay. Put the card off to the side. One, two, three, four. Psychic type energy, Simisage, Blowing Smoke, Turbo Patch, Bunnel Bay, Toxel, Sinstina, Carablast, Meltan, Worst Hall of a Nicket, and a final card will be a Dark Rye. Okay. And this one's a pain to open. Okay. Go across to the side. One, two, three, four. Fire type energy, Soul Rock, Relicath, Gelhorn, Trapinch, Hyersa, Panacea, Moro, Wishiwashi, Worst Hall of a Gramble, and the final card is the Belly Cat. Now that I'm looking at the code cards, now that I'm not looking at the code cards, it's a lot harder now to determine if I'm gonna be excited or not in the booster pack. Oh, that's the whole point. But I haven't been looking at the code cards too often. Like every now and then I'll glance beforehand. So it wasn't just me looking at the code cards and debating for me to be excited. Next one will be. But I'm not even letting the code cards sit on the table. Like I'm letting them fall on the floor. So maybe I shouldn't have put the word as hard. It's not hard not to look at them. This isn't staged though. I don't want anybody thinking that because I know a lot of YouTubers get a lot of conspiracy theories saying that their videos are staged. If I'm going to open something, I'm going to open it on camera to share it with you guys. I make the ultimate sacrifice of waiting till I have camera and I'm at my studio. I actually once waited 48 hours after receiving a product to wait to film it. And that was the Dark Ride GX box. The shiny one. Last pack magic. Can we get one last pack magic? Oh, yes. So last pack magic does exist. But will it happen to us? Dark type energy, Glenwood Tangle, Lyron, Parasect, Tauros, Ricky D, Larry Mr. Mime, Electric, Dino, Reverse Hall of a Toxapex, on a card be a hollow kilo spot so not too bad after purchasing these booster boxes uh i can pretty much almost guarantee you that there will be more darkness ablaze in the future but i'll have to check put all these cards in the binder see if it's worth to even buy boosters for darkness ablaze see how many cards i'm missing and if i'm just gonna buy the rest of the set if i do end up completing darkness ablaze i will share with you guys and nowhere near completing the ultra rares the way i look at it is if you're so close to completing a set where you have all of the normal type cards just buy the rest of the ultra rares unless it's something like burning shadows or hidden fates then i recommend if you see boosters for those sets buy them 
that's what I do at least. I bought some hidden fates and actually managed to pull myself the Zard, which is very, very cool. Wasn't expecting that to happen. So two pulls to summarize. Oh no, three. Salamance and Center Scorch. And now that I'm out of here, I'll let Nicole take over. So, Nicole? I'm okay. Alright. That is Darkness Ablaze wrapped up for me. Alright, so we finish it off? Yes, sir. Alrighty. Alright, we got our last 18 here from on my end. But there will be more. Yeah, that's for sure. Still hoping for that Zard. Electric type energy, combuskin, glimwood tangle, lyron, vanilla, trap inch, teddy ursa, panseer, morlol, verse hall of an arctazolt. The final card will be an ambroise. I actually needed that. I was actually worried there was going to be a hollow for a second. You can ask me, I have the card. Leaf type energy, Saravia, Zoalos. Puppertar, Perlion, Starly, Aaron, Cubchoo, Relit, First Hall of a Ducklet, and the final card will be a Hollow Dark Rye. Not a bad looking card. So, Doctors as Blaze does overall seem like a pretty nice set. Parasect. Spike Mouth, Cape of Toughness, Wishy Washy, Cuffin, Dino, Panseer, Mareep, Reverse Hall, Wishy Washy, and a Swana. Definitely done seeing Swanas. <laughs> I've seen way too many of those. Yep. Steel Type Energy, Vibretha, Simi Seer, Lunatone, Snubble. Toros, Rookity, Galarian Mr. Mime, Electric, Reverse Hollow Rose Tower, and the final card will be a Hollow Pincher Chin. Not actually sure why he got a Hollow. He's nothing too good. He is cute. Parasex, Toxpex, oh, no, Big Particle, Dunsparce, Electric, Galarian Mr. Mime, Grammar, Clink, Verse Hollow Vanillish, and a Talon Flame. That's a nice one. If anything, Pincherchin and Payukumuku should be counterparts. They should be the same Pokemon. No, they the look same. almost the same. It's pretty. Pincherchin is just a money thing. Not Payukumuku. Just yeah. A repeat. Payukumuku is definitely cuter. Saravia, like Pupitar, Zwalos, Dino, Pessimon, Funnel Bay, Vanillite, Gothita, Reverse Hall of a Starly, and a Flygon. How are you doing up there? Anything uh, summarized to me right now? Well, got in a hollow pincher chin. I had a hollow dark eye, but now it's no V's or anything. Oh. Hopefully that changes. Hopefully it's a Charizard, or at least a Crobat. Pokemon Breeders Nurturing, Fletchender, Hidden Energy, Jigglypuff, Diglett, Panpour, Spinarak, Bone Sweet, Reverse Hollow of a Mr. Mime, and a final card will be a Charizard VMAX! Oh my god, you got it? Oh my god! I was hoping for one of these. Oh my god, you got it? Yes! Oh my god. My dream has come true. A Charizard VMAX. I finally got my hands on one of those. Yeah. Whew. That was a lot of work, though. It what was. booster pack spent to get that? Money well spent, though. That's like a really expensive card. I think, right? It is. As of the time of, war, of us recording this video, uh, yeah, it's pretty expensive. Yeah. <laughs> I'd say it is. Congratulations, we both got Zard now. Yes. Writing type energy, Shinotic, Rose, Semipore, Skitty, Pansage, Gullet, Vanillate, Trapinch, Reverse Hollow of a Trapinch, and a Hollow Dracovish. I definitely can't complain at this point. That's amazing. 
rough. It is amazing. Whew. These are even really cool. Yep. Sorry about that. There will be plenty, plenty of PCD products in the future. I'm, I'm talking sooner than later, trust me. Yeah, way sooner. Oh, it's alright. Gotta stand and try that again. Yeah, I did that. Look, look at hovering. Sorry, Why that is. Sense? Yes, please. That was my fault. I'm very sorry. It's alright. Okay, I think I fixed it. We'll just cut it out. All right, electric surf energy, Fletchender, rare, rare fossil, ferret, nickit, shelmet, larvitar, grimer, galarian duramaca, reverse hollow of a galarian duraman, duramatan, and a digger's bay. Still can't believe that we got the Charizard. Lunatone, Dartrix, Wimwood Tangle, Teddy Ursa, Panseer, Morlal, Wishy Washy, Cuffint, First Hall of Aguilas Pod, and the final card will be a Gradient. Oh, I can't even complain if I don't get any more Ultra Rares from here. Charizard is the rarest in the set, correct? Yes, sir. And then you have Crobat yeah. being, I believe, one of the most valuable. Flaffy, Eridos, Familiar Ball, Centred, Rowlet, Squovit, Spinarak, Larvesta, Verse Hollow of a Toxapex, and a Bear Tig. Oh, the is the most valuable. I'll pick the most rarest. I believe Crobat at the most rare. Yeah, and... I'd say maybe Eridos, Rainbow Rare, most rare. Ah. That's kind of up there. It's a little bit. It's a little bit more expensive than Crobat. So, Lyron, Simipore, Spike Mouth, Dino, Panseer, Mareep, Snubble, Tauros, First Hollow Parasect, and the Salamans V Full Art on a roll. Got the Charizard and a Full Art. Salamans V does seem to have a pretty nice Full Art. I like what they did in Darkness Ablaze with the full art backgrounds. I don't like the hollow though. Yeah, I get what they were trying to intend, but they didn't do it very well. I like the X and Y hollow. Oh yeah, those are definitely pretty nice. Did you see the XY Evolutions one there? Yeah. It's literally 3D. Rose Tower, Steeny, Dedene, Hippopotas, Gullet, Skitty, Dino, Jigglypuff, First Hollow Larvitar, and a River, and a Hollow Decidueye. Already down to our last five. Still very happy about that Charizard. Because you can't get better than a Charizard. Bird Keeper, Steeny, Furret, Rickety, Glaring Mr. Mime, Electric, Dino, Passiamon, Reverse Hall of a Pansage, and another Swana. <laughs> Let me know when I've seen enough of them. I've been my regular rare too many times. Fabritha, Corvusire, Rose, Dunsparce, Clink, Marini, Torchic, Starly, Verse Hollow Blaziken, Final Card will be a Salamance V Max! Do you know what it'll get? Not yet. I got a Salamance V Full Art and the Salamance V Max. That is some last pack magic that's pulls. The, that's the V Max now. Yep, three more packs to go.
Yellhorn, Flaffy, Carnivine, Bunnel Bay, Vanilla, Gothita, Shelmet, Reverse Hall of a Gothitella, and the final card will be a Hollow Heatran. That. Two Hollow Heatrans out. Yeah. Well, I can help with this one. I need one. Then I will gladly trade one to you. Thanks. It's not like I need two of them. We like to help each other on our collections. Help each other complete sets. Oh, that's really cool. Vanillish, Poltygeist, Solrock, Skamori, Pansash, Electric, Fletchling, Galarian Mr. Mime, Reverse Hollow of a Carnivine, and a Clink Clank. Alright, final pack. Let's hope something good comes out of it. Oh, bless you. Grass type energy, Cape of Toughness, Powerful Energy, Solar Rock, Larvitar, Grimer, Valerian Duramaca, Centret, Relic, Verse Hall of Atoros, and the final card will be a Manectric. Well, that's all the packs I've got. Thank you. Yeah, alrighty. So, on my end, we got Charizard V Max, probably the best, Salamence V Full Art. And Salamence V Max. Uh, take mine over here. No, those are yours. Well, you guys already saw mine, so. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll talk to you all next time. And with that being said, have a good day.